Alright, so I was just playing around. I got my HA2 torch. I juice up the amps a little bit. I'm probably about 12 amp now. Still putting out. I just tested it yesterday. It was 550 mil in 45 seconds. So not a whole lot. But then I got my propane torch, and just a regular bronze matic just the kind of shit you get with more and more. You see, I'm just adding, so you got your breather holes. Get your breather holes in the torch head. So yeah, it's only a little tiny bit of fuel. <laughs> but even on a great big I think it'll come up on the video. See the flames at a set size. I'm not going to touch my fuel. Just adding the HHO makes a. It changes from a darker blue to a brighter blue. Yeah, it's coming up. And it gets smaller. So even with the torch cranked up, so it's I'm flowing as much propane as I can, a tiny, tiny little bit of difference in the. And a little bit of HHO that I'm putting in there makes a big difference in how it's burning. <laughs> I don't know why I like making it pop. Well, I thought it was pretty interesting. It, it changes how the propane burns that much. And you see, it's just I'm still just a little tiny HHO flame. See that? It, make, it actually makes the blue suck clear back into the tip. I would assume it's making it burn hotter. But I don't really have a water heater set up. But I guess you could. Uh, my, my next test is going to be to try adding, cutting some propane in with the HHO in the line before the torch head. And if it works like I'm thinking, I should be able to uh, hold a better torch flame, even with a bigger hole.
Oh, oh.